to speed up the paternity results? Yes, I thought it would ease your mind to know the truth one way or the other. You're right. It's time we all stop speculating. Easier said than done. I'm scared. I, I want to find out who the father is. <laughs> You're afraid it's mine. You want it to be Lucky's. Before we proceed, have you spoken to my grandson, Nicholas, about the paternity test? No. Taken any money to alter the results? No. That is, except what you're paying me. And you are absolutely sure these are true and accurate results on Elizabeth Weber's paternity test? And before you say anything, it's important you know deceit makes me very cranky. The results are accurate, I swear. I performed the paternity test myself and double-checked it. Are you sure that Ethan was the one who attacked you? Yes, it was Ethan. Why would Ethan beat you? Isn't this delicious? So oh, really, it is the best outcome imaginable. I thought you'd be angry that the baby's father is Lucky Spencer. Well, it is a trifle unexpected when you factor in the number of times that my grandson tossed that little strumpet compared to poor Lucky Spencer. But it makes it all the more convincing. All what? Well, the sordid history of the Spencers and the Cassidines is about to come to a fitting outcome. You're absolutely sure that Nicholas is not the father? The test is higher than 99% conclusive. Wow, oh, wonderful. I can hardly wait till Nicholas brings the baby home. But if it's not his... You are going to alter the results. Everyone outside this room will believe that Nicholas is the father of Elizabeth's baby. But I and my unknowing grandson will raise a Spencer to be a Cassidine. Oh, it's a glorious irony. That child will be taught to hate all things Spencer, to wreak havoc on them, until Luke's family comes completely undone by one of their own. I'm gonna love this baby regardless of who the father is. You're avoiding the question. And this test is supposed to tell us if the baby's healthy. Really, that's all that matters. I agree with that. I'm just asking you to be honest. I'm looking forward to raising this child as a single mother. I feel comforted knowing that you and Lucky are, are willing to be fathers if you have to. Which means Lucky or I We'll be a part of your life, sharing custody, getting together for birthdays and yeah, holidays. He already does and... that. He's Cameron and Jake's dad. He loves those boys. Nothing's going to change that. And that leaves me the wild card. And Liz, essentially, your life stays the same unless I'm the father. It would be easier for all of us if Lucky's the father. I went to the haunted store tonight to see Ethan. Did he ask you to come? No. But he's been really nice and paying attention to me. I thought he liked me. So I got dressed up and went to see him. But he got mad and said I was too young. And I embarrassed him. Did he say that? He grabbed me really hard and said... He said that I should stop playing games. And then he made me leave. Were there any witnesses? Your dad was there and a lot of other people. The, the casino was open, everyone saw. She doesn't have to do this right now, does she? Oh, Can she? Okay. Just just take your time, okay? It happened when I went home. 
Ethan showed up. He was furious and out of control. And he started hitting me. And I begged him to stop, but he just kept hitting and hitting. I thought he cared about me. <laughs> it's okay. Can, can she can she talk about this later? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I'll, I'll consider that her, her statement for now. But listen, since Christine is still a minor, I'm going to need to speak to you and son. So... Nicholas, I know you think you want a life with me, but... No, it's, fi it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm sorry. I promised not to press you while, while you were in here. You're just gonna wait till I get out? <laughs> it's been a long time since I've seen you smile, Liz. You remember when we all used to laugh together? You and me and Lucky? Yeah, yeah, I do. <sighs> Haven't had much reason to laugh lately, have we? Maybe this baby will change all that. Has Lucky been in touch to ask when the test results will be in? No, no, I haven't heard from him. It's the hospital. Nicholas Cassadine. Mr. Cassadine? I'm calling from the lab at General Hospital. I'm sorry, but there's been a delay with Elizabeth Weber's test. We won't have the results until tomorrow. Sonny? Put the gun down. No. Nope. What's going on? Nope. Christina just ID'd Ethan as her assailant. I never laid a hand on Christina, I swear, because she's lying. You say that again, I will blow. Sonny, you... Sonny, take it easy. You got two cops here and an unarmed man, okay? You... Don't do anything stupid. You didn't hit Christina? How'd you get the scratch on your face? When I picked her up to take her to the ER, she was scared and disoriented. She lashed out, but I did not beat her. There is nothing lower than a man who beats women and children. You are garbage. And I can guarantee you one thing. You're gonna pay. Look, I would never hit Christina, okay? I was horrified when I found her. She has to be lying. Why? Why would she lie about this? I don't know. Maybe she was upset from rejecting her. Rejecting her? Yeah, look, I admit, I was a little harsh with Christina when she came in here tonight, but it was the only way to get through to... You need to stop talking. You need to let him explain. Look, Christina probably lied because she felt humiliated when I told her to get out of here. Everything you're saying, you're just incriminating yourself more. Lucky, all I did was grab her arm. I'm taking you down to the station. You're under arrest. 